know the SEC schedule is getting serious when it's Georgia Tennessee week, the 42nd meeting, and this is set for between the hedges in Athens. And this is a meeting between two of the top offenses in the SEC. Both average well over 500 yards per game. It's time for Game Day Central. I'm Al Keck. The Bulldogs are the first to show off their offense. They go 84 yards on their opening drive. The freshman, Todd Gurley, plows in from the two, 7-0 Georgia. But Tennessee counters with its defense. It's soon they'll all play the same yeah. offense. Oh, he got it. Intercepted. Picked off, and here we go. It's Brian Moore in for the touchdown. 7-7 seven, seven, midway through the first. But Georgia settles down, and the other freshman running back gets in on the act. This is Keith Marshall, another freshman, and he can fly. There are no flags. There is a Georgia touchdown. Georgia rolls up 234 yards of offense in the first quarter. Georgia gets more in the second. It's Gurley again. Gurley behind great blocking. He pulls away for a third touchdown, 51 yards, 27-10 Georgia. But Tennessee comes storming back. The Volunteers are all over Aaron Murray, the sack and the fumble. Tennessee takes over at the eight. Moments later, Tyler Bray hits Zach Rogers for the touchdown and the balls cut it to 27-23, but they miss the point after. After another Georgia fumble, Tennessee takes the lead. Bray with the pass to Rajon Neal. Don't look now, but Tennessee has 20 unanswered points and leads 30 to 27 late in the second. And the final play of the first half, Georgia kicker Marshall Morgan, 50 yards. Like that, it's tied at 30 at halftime. That is some kind of first half. The big plays keep coming in the second half. Down 43-30, Tennessee's Cordero Patterson comes running to the rescue. First down and 10. Reverse. He can throw, but he's not open. So he's going to have to keep it, and he'll do so. How about this? Patterson to the 10. In for the touchdown. And one of the Georgia kids comes through again. Does he throw, and he put it right there. Mitchell left side, huge hole, cut back, breaks the tackle, foot race is on. It's Marshall, 72 yards. Georgia clinging to a 51-44 lead inside two minutes. Bray fumbles. John Jenkins recovers at the 31. And as Tennessee has one final chance, Sanders Cummings gets his second interception. Is it intercepted? Yep. If it is, it's yep. Cummings. That's his second. Georgia survives a wild one, 51-44. The Bulldogs go to 5-0, and the Dogs head to South Carolina next week. Tennessee falls to 3-2 and, and has a bye week. Stay connected. We have all the top plays from all the big games. They're only one click away, and the only place to see them is right here on the SEC. Digital Network.